Colonel Mbongeni Fagudze, Eswatini-born award-winning artist. And he's been in South Africa for around three years now, inspired by strong women. And this is evidenced in the dignified way in which he projects females in his artwork. Now, he says his, his art explores the concept of solidity versus fluidity versus gaseousness. Now, I've always seen the world through the microscopic eye of an atomic physicist with, uh, and simultaneously the cosmic eye of an astrophysicist and uh, living in a society like ours where there is a continuous display of disregard of women. We talk to him about what influences his work. Thanks so much for coming through, Mbungin. Thanks, thanks. So, nice to be here. Um, uh, all these uh, scientific terms and, you know, uh, has me wondering, what exactly uh, is that about? Okay, so um, personally, I've, 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 I've got a very scientific, scientific background um, to me as well, you know. Um, I, I, I happen to, be, to, to, to excel during my high school years in, 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 in physics. And it was very interesting to me to understand how matter how the universe was actually how the universe was actually formed and how matter objects and everything sort of work together so um, this is how then it, it was able to feed into the work that i do um, in the sense that um, we are we in in art we are also creating objects and these objects have to take a, a certain form so through through this form uh, it's sort of like um, the, 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 whole, the whole concept, the whole, the whole, th th these are physical concepts that sort of begin to feed into artistic concepts. So women and your portrayal of them through your artwork. Firstly, why women? Why that specific focus? Okay, so um, it's, it, 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 began, it, it began really as a search. Uh, 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 I had a great interest in 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 in, in what they call um, figure drawing and figure figure art, which is the understanding of the human body and the the the, the mechanics of the human body and so on. Um, so, um, which by the way, I, I, uh, during my university years, I, I, I got an award. I got an award for that for being one of one of the top top. Um, Figure, figure, figure drawing art artists in, in, in my class. Okay, so then from there it was like I, I, I started to scale down, scale, scale down my subject, my subject scaled down, scaled down, and um, it was it, 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 the, 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 the feature of, of, of just the face. First it was just the face, and then from the face it, it, it continued to scale down to um, focus more on women. And at, at the moment, that's 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 the subject matter that 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 I, I'm kind of um, heavily focused on. Do you find uh, that you are able to make a living off your artwork? Um, I could say I'm making a pretty good living. Oh, off my that's that's, <laughs> that's very interesting because often we talk about struggling artists. Yeah. yeah. So, uh, uh, what would you say is the difference in your case? Um. I don't know. Actually, I, I could say I was, I was able to position myself, um, especially when I arrived in Joburg. I was able to position myself among, among a group of, of very vibrant and, um, and recognized artists, uh, which is in a building down, downtown um, called uh, August House. Uh, where, there's, where there's a group of about 52, 52 plus um, uh, almost fully full-time full -time artists who, or who own studios there. So I, uh, the, uh, I think that's, that's, that's really what brought me into, into a sort of fertile, fertile environment. I didn't, I didn't really have to struggle that much. I could go to my neighbor and ask him about who to talk to or... Mm -hmm. and so on and so forth so and it was it was much easier for people to access to ex to access me through that space well we are unfortunately out of time but maybe you could just talk us out of this interview by mm. telling us about this particular painting mm. who is this okay so this is um so this is a, a, a this is a combination of, of of various of various elements 
what 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 I was trying to present is mainly just an African face that I I I, I don't sometimes I I try to um, interpret a face and make it uh, to represent someone, but in most cases it's more. It's more, it's more um, abstracting from, from, from a face, from different faces that I've seen into forming probably a, 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 a single, almost imaginary character. So, unfortunately, fortunately or unfortunately for this one, it's not a particular person. Oh. Right, right. All right. Yeah. Uh, well, Mungini, thanks for coming. Uh, I thought it was me. I mean, <laughs> it's, it's, it really is that beautiful. I thought it was me. But uh, thank you all the same, um, Mungini Fagutse, on uh, his work as an artist. And as he says, many of them, more than 50 of them, in a building, August House, downtown, downtown Johannesburg. That's where they sit. And let's support local art. Let's go to a break.